today I'm going to show you very famous dish that's an Indian recipe that is called masala alu or Bombay potato for this recipe I can say it is not famous only in India it's also famous in all over the world so I thought why do uh, why not I will share with this this recipe with you uh, so for this recipe you will need boiled potato and green chili is optional uh, cumin seed uh, ginger I just take a half an inch ginger and just make the julienne, asafetato, red chili powder and uh, coriander powder, garam masala, salt, turmeric is optional if you want to just make your uh, Bombay potato a little bit yellow so otherwise I'm going to avoid this today and clarifying butter and any oil. So uh, to, go, uh, to start this recipe you will need just crush the potatoes first like this gently so be careful while you are just using your potato it should be nice quality uh, today i just took the maris uh, this potato i will show you and this is a maris piper potatoes so i use this because this is not a sweet enough so i'm going to crush it first like this now i'm going to uh, take a pan this is nice non-stick pan. I'm going to put some clarifying butter in my pan. This is a two spoon of butter I took and a little bit I'm going to take a now I'm going to add some as a fetito. This is now I'm going to add one spoon one and a half spoon cumin powder you can see it is now already started to crackling now so as it crackles so you need to do you need to do uh, in this potatoes you just add all the your dry masalas this is gram masala i just put half a one and a, two spoon i can say two spoon uh, coriander powder and chili be careful as much hot you want just uh, according to your taste you can add the chili I'm going to take a uh, half a spoon chili and uh, little bit green chili as I'm going to add this as you can see now cumin is all started crackle now so I'm going to add ginger julienne in this to make a little bit fry them As you can see it started a little bit brown now add all the potatoes inside the pan and keep it stirring and if you think your stove is high so just try to make it slow down a little bit you need it just medium heat for this now I'm going to add some salt in this point I'm going to add one spoon salt if you can adjust a little bit later as well so the key of the bombay potato is this you need to fry it nice and brown as much as can in my potatoes i would like a little bit more oil so it gives gives us get the potatoes nice coating a nice crispy coating so i'm going to add a little bit more it's optional if you don't like too much oil just avoid that but i like crispy potatoes so i'm going to add this make them brown keep it stirring just keep turning them so it is not going to burn one side it's a really easy and quick recipe but it's as i can say it's easy but it's a really tasty as well you can see now starting brown and crispy side as well so you need to brown around two minutes just keep leave like that leave like it while it's just going to cook i'm going to just 
take some fresh coriander for garnishing I'm going to chop them roughly Chopping board here. With a knife. That's finally chopped now. And you can see now potato is also ready. Now can you see it's nice uh, golden coating is now finished. So it, it means potato is ready. I call them masala potato. You can see that nice masala coating all over my potatoes. If you add a uh, turmeric, it gives more yellowish color. But I don't like yellow color in my masala potato. I like the original color of red chili. So I will avoid that. Now it's done. I'm going to turn off the stove. And I'm going to turn off eating my potatoes. Look at that nice yet golden masala potato. Oh, Bombay potato is ready now. Perfect. I can smell lovely smell of garam masala, my homemade masala. I just use that for this. And nice green chili, you can see all over there is coated very well now. I'm going to add a little bit green coriander on top of that. And it's ready for eat now. Thank you for watching me and enjoy your bomber potato.